What's up, team? We're back here at the Nickopedia. This, this is a new lab. New lab. <laughs> new space. Today, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do one of the most classic science experiments ever. As a kid, you probably always wanted to do this. Parents said no. But now that I'm an adult, I can do this in my own free time. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make this little tater fly. Because today, we're gonna be making a potato gun. So what you need for the tater cannon, you need a chamber, this is your combustion chamber. This is where you're gonna put your aerosol spray. This right here is our like, our barrel. That's where the actual tater is gonna be flying down. Then all these are components that allow us to seal off the combustion chamber. So what you need is you need this called a reducer. So it goes from four inch to two inch. That goes on there and you glue it. So this is the reducer. Then this two inch goes into here. We're gonna glue that. Blah. So you can already see the shape of our spud gun. Oof. Then we connect this to here. And then our cap. Now the reason you want the cap is so that you can unscrew the cap, spray your fuel in there, your stoic mixture, your air fuel mixture. So then you need, you need a way to, to ignite that mixture. So what we have here, is a hot shot igniter, single spark. You press the button and it, there's another wire and it gaps and it sparks. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a hole in this, we're gonna drill a hole, and then we're going to seal it off with epoxy. And then inside there we're gonna have a little spark. Very, very, very last step, we're gonna sharpen the edge here so that we can jam the tater down in there. We're gonna get a broomstick, push it all the way down in there, and then we light her up. We give it a little, a little poke. Poosh. Here's one thing that is just not really well explained on instructions on a lot of the videos and like the diagrams uh, for making a spud gun, and that is the ignition source. Now, I got this at hardware store. So we're gonna drill a hole about that, about that size right there. We're just gonna put this down in there, and we're gonna seal up around it with epoxy. Still got our spark in there. Kind of looks like, um, like a Sith Lord, you know? It's all black and it's got this one little lightsaber thing kind of going on right here, a little black. You know, it kind of looks like Darth Vader's suit. I will call you... Darth Potato. Okie dokie. So what I'm doing here is I'm uh, shaving the sides here. I'm gonna make this like really sharp. So then when we load our potato in there, boom. It kind of slices the rest of the potato so it's a perfect like seal inside the barrel so it builds a lot of pressure so it shoots that potato out. Because we don't want any, you know, we don't want the explosion coming around the side of the potato. We want to get a potato that's just a little over this size. Boom. All right, so there we go. Sharpen the edges. Pretty sharp. Um, I think a little potato in there is going to get, it's going to get squished pretty easily. And so we're going to cut this eight inches. I'm gonna attach this plate to that. And then I'm gonna attach this to here. And then we're gonna attach that whole mechanism to this tripod right here. Ugh. Which also looks very dark light. That's, that's, that's it, that's, we did it. I, I put all this together so I can mix the awesome sound effects for you guys. Okay, we're gonna test out our Darth potato and we're looking down through the pipe to actually aim it where we want it to go. We want it to go right in that trash can. Just want to make sure that our Darth potato is functional. So, I'm gonna go ahead and load this guy in. And you load it all the way in. Three, four, five. All right. 
That definitely works. That was really loud. Let's go check out the damage. Wow. That, oh my God, that was, it's spectacular. That is going to do some damage. Wow. 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 Wrecked. Wrecked. That, I mean, there, that is a lot of force behind that. Um, if you like this video, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Uh, if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button because next video, we're going to be taking Darth Potato out to the desert. We're running all sorts of tests. And again, just to reiterate, uh, this is like super dangerous. We do not endorse this experiment if you are not 18 years old. Um, if you are uh, over 18 years old, uh, you can totally do this, um, but precaution. If you're under 18 years old, make sure that you do it with the supervision of a parent. And I'll see you guys really soon.